President Marcos has ordered an investigation into the collision incident between the Chinese Coast Guard and Philippine resupply ships in the West Philippine Sea. On Monday, the President called a command conference with all security agencies to discuss China's, quote, latest violation in the West Philippine Sea. There, the palace said Marcos instructed the Philippine Coast Guard to conduct a probe into what it described as dangerous and illegal, reckless maneuvers by Chinese Coast Guard vessels. Malacanang adds that the matter is being taken seriously at the highest level of government. Defense Secretary Gibo Chodoro said that aside from the strong condemnation of the incident, the president also wants Philippine authorities to ensure protection of our territory. China has no legal right or authority to conduct law enforcement operations in our territorial waters and in our exclusive economic zone. This is a serious escalation of the illegal activities conducted by the Chinese government in the West Philippine Sea in complete disregard of any norm or convention of international law. The Foreign Affairs Department has also summoned Chinese Ambassador to Manila, Huang Xilian, and lodged a diplomatic protest over the incident. However, the Chinese envoy did not show up since he was supposedly out of town. Chinese Deputy of Mission Zhu Ziyong met with the DFA instead. Since 2020, the Philippines has filed over 460 diplomatic protests against China. 122 of those were filed under the Marcos administration.